This is TBNN. We interrupt this video to bring you a special announcement. We will continue with your video after this short announcement. There is a massive boycott with YouTube and its advertisers happening right now. This boycott threatens our existence as well as the entire YouTube channel database. You can do a search on Google to confirm this boycott. We urge you to help by supporting our channel with a $1 donation, just $1, to help offset our growing expenses. Our staff is working diligently to keep you informed and up to date on events and intel that you have grown accustomed to receiving. Our staff produce over 70 videos on a daily basis in English and in Spanish. This is a tremendous undertaking. This is why we use a computerized voice because of the massive amount of information we provide for you. We accept PayPal donations and our donation link is below in our description. When the boycott is over, we'll let you know. This is a serious situation for YouTube and its advertisers. If you appreciate our channel and the intel that we provide for you, then please, please consider this much needed $1 donation. I want to personally thank you in advance for your support. And now, here is your scheduled video. Trump signs bill allowing vets to turn to the private sector to reduce wait times. By Kim Smith. President Donald Trump took another step toward ensuring that the country's veterans can receive health care when they need it. On Wednesday. The president signed legislation that temporarily expands a program at the Department of Veterans Affairs that allows patients to seek care from private doctors if they opt to bypass the VA's broken system. The Veterans Choice Improvement Act allows the VA to continue operating its choice program beyond the August 7 expiration date, ABC News reported. The program will now operate until funding for it runs out, which is expected early next year. The extension allows VA Secretary David Shulkin time to develop a plan that allows veterans the ability to seek medical care outside of Virginia. As he signed the bill, Trump said the program will continue to be able to see the doctor of their choice and noted that veterans have not been taken care of properly. You got it? The doctor of their choice, he repeated, according to the Associated Press. Shulkin, who was present when Trump signed the bill, said the money was needed to pay for stopgap services while he worked out a better plan, which he said was due in the fall. Congress would then have to approve any changes made to the VA health system. Policy Director at Concerned Veterans for America Dan Caldwell said the program was a good first step. Extending the choice program is the right thing to do, but only as a stopgap measure until better solutions are developed and implemented, he said according to the Washington Examiner. It certainly is the right thing to do, and it's good to see Trump following through on his word to help improve health care for veterans. Share this story on Facebook and Twitter if you agree that this legislation is a good first step is overhauling the broken VA health care system. What do you think about this legislation? Scroll down to comment below. That's the news. Join us here every day. Be sure to subscribe and click the bell. See you next time. This is TBNN.